Hello everyone, and welcome back to Stonehearth. Uh, today, we got a few things going on. Uh, the main, most important thing is these carrots for a maybe rabbit. Now, last episode we didn't have much. I think we had four out of five. We saw that we had enough on the ground, but we just hadn't picked it up yet. And we actually had a trader come past in between episodes while I was, uh, you know, letting them build some walls and whatnot. Uh, and I bought all their carrots, which was extremely lucky. I think we could have also called in uh, some traders and possibly gotten a farmer. So, I guess we'll do this. We'll click complete. We'll leave some carrots out. And now, we wait. We'll leave the carrots out past the edge of town overnight. Wonder if they'll still be there in the morning. Okay. I, I don't know if we'd be able to see it. Like, if they would actually place it somewhere. I assume not. I assume they just say that they've placed them somewhere. That's... My best guess. What's this up here? A little bird of some sort. I say a little, the bird was huge. <laughs> um, we also have another thing here. That weird bird again. Looks like Mur is getting in touch with us again. Open it. A letter. Dear Trillwoodites. <laughs> Word around the capital is that your settlement has grown since I last saw it. And that it's getting even more bustling by the day. Your hearth must be burning brightly to attract so many new settlers. In fact... It's also attracted the attention of a few notable individuals. Okay. As you probably know, a settlement traditionally needs a sponsorship to become a true, st a true township. Generally from a guild, the clergy, or the military. Okay. In the past few days, I've been approached by a few individuals who are very interested to get a look at your town for themselves. And see if you'd be interested in allowing them to be your sponsor. Okay. Next time I visit, I'll bring these folks along with me and let them plead their cases, decisions, decisions. Until then, yours in the capital, Mer Burly Hands. <laughs> Until then, Mer. Okay. So it looks like we're going to get another upgrade going on. Now, as you can see, we've also, uh, in between episodes, if we have enough, we uh, I let someone in. Uh, I've been allowing people in. So uh, they recommend 20, and above 20, it might lag a bit. So, <laughs> I mean, it. The game is laggy, right? But it's been, I feel, the same amount of laggy since we've been at 20. So, I I feel like it's not getting worse. I mean, it's probably getting a little bit worse, but but not enough. Uh, and surprisingly, we've actually got enough food for the next um, uh, cert, uh, citizen. Yeah, the, the next citizen. But we don't have enough uh, net worth. That's uh, a little bit surprising to me, honestly. But um, I guess we'll play. Now, I got these walls built and I tore down the previous walls here. We built this wall as well. And I think we're just waiting on a bit of stone. Now, I'm not sure if they have enough stone to complete it. Oh, we could also get some of this. Here's the thing. I don't think they'll even... Um, or does it not want to? Do I have to harvest this? I do. That's a bit weird. Um, I have requested them to go mine. It's very laggy when I play. Especially at the start as well. I've noticed when I, when I load up the game. I think it's because they start off with no goals. And then like... You know, my computer has to figure out what they're all doing. Oh, I pressed my DPI button. <laughs> so, we'll let them all figure out what they're doing. If you look here, you know, they're doing a bunch of stuff. We still have some people idle. They'll figure out what they're doing in a little bit, hopefully. Um, I have requested them to mine out... Oh, mine out a bit of uh, stuff up here. If we click on this, we should see it. Yeah, I've asked them to mine out this bit. They haven't gotten to it yet. Um, the ladder's there. Everything should be fine. Is it, In fact, oh no. I thought that person might be going to mine. So they're just not doing it. So they're doing a whole bunch of other things. I understand building the wall. In fact, that's weird though. They mined this stuff. Is that because it was a harvest and not a um, an actual mine order? That might be what it was. If that's the case, we can request some of this stuff to get mined. That might be alright. Maybe that and that. It is... <laughs> I like how I'm talking about it. it hasn't gotten worse laggy, and now this is like the laggiest we've ever seen it. Um, I mean, the other thing is I'm, I'm obviously recording, and, and that's taking a bit out of my system. And because this is a Steam game, it has Steam open in the background as well. Th there's a few little irritating bits, but look. Oh, <laughs> look at these. Some oh, they're gone again. <laughs> the, the smooth FPS is gone. Um, so the main part of uh, expanding this out is I want to build two more pastures, or at least one, for wool. Now, originally... Oh, okay. Um, I'll pause this for a second. Originally, I wanted the wool for a bed, right? Because this comfy bed is worth 15 appeal, and it uses a bundle of wool. And this fur bed is worth 12, right? So I thought that was the best. But if we look here at this 
uh, post post a bed, post a bed. Um, it's actually a large bed, so I think it takes up extra space, but it does 20, and it only uses cloth. So that might be the play. Uh, a comfy animal bed, that might be nice. And then obviously these beds are just horrible. This bed will, would obviously be elite, but uh, we don't have gold flakes. So I do want to have the wool, and obviously we'll get the meat from it as well, which will be pretty good, but... Yeah, I, I'm not too sure. I can look at these other guys. Do these guys have beds? They do. They have fur beds. That's worth 14, so that's actually pretty close. This uh, burn comfy bed is 21, though. That's actually really good, and that uses wool. Okay, that, that is actually extremely good. We, we might go towards getting these. Um, I doubt the blacksmith would have a bed. Uh, we can have a look. Um, would the weaver somehow have a bed? It has a, a bed roll, and this is worth one. So, so I think this is very much, um, I guess, on the go, right? Um, I wonder if they actually hold this, because I, it does say furniture. Because it says you can carry. Well, to be honest, you can actually carry any bed. <laughs> that, that, is, that is true in this game. That's a pr pretty funny statement. Um... Okay, so we might go for that bone, uh, the bone bed that was here. We might go for that. Um, uh, yeah. Because the, the other alternative would need gold flakes. And, um, although that is doable, I don't actually personally know where any gold is. I would have to look for it, uh, and we might actually have to go mining for it. Right? Uh, we could obviously buy it off of someone. But I, the fact that I don't see any gold, I'm not actually sure. Oh, obviously, it's rare, right? Because it's a really good resource. But I don't know just how rare and whether um, we'll find it like in the ground or something. This is gold right here, isn't it? We've actually got a decent amount of gold up there. Um, oh, we have gold right here. Okay, that might be doable then. Yeah, yeah, that might be doable. Let's um, slap a... A ladder here, a ladder here, and can we mine out this and this? Uh, this ladder will change. We'll, we'll make it just be a normal size ladder. Ooh, look at all that gold! Oh, <laughs> we are rich. <laughs> oh, look at all that gold. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my gold, should I say. Okay. And then these bits we can just individually mine out. I assume that's the ends. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, we can zoom in a little bit. We can't actually go into the mountain though. Interesting. There's a lot of gold this direction. I should have just mined out the whole block, shouldn't I? How much gold is there? Oh my god. Okay. Let's just let's just do that. We'll use the stone too. I mean, like it's not the end. Oh my god. Is there just endless gold? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, we're not going to mine all that out. Is there endless gold here too? Maybe. That is nuts. That <laughs> what? Can we actually select the bit down there? I don't think we can. <laughs> no, I don't think we can. Alright, well, that's fine. I oh, I think we would do it like this? No? I don't know how to... I guess by splicing. Uh, slicing, I mean. We could probably do... Um this. And we could suspend this, and, and that's pretty fine for now. We'll leave that. <laughs> that is a lot of gold. I, I'm, I'm shocked. Uh, okay, we'll read this. So this is a guild that is selling us food, it looks like. Ah. Huh. Um, now, Funky, we don't actually have any fungus. I'm assuming we could probably turn it into seeds, right? Or is there even some seeds here? These are flowers. Daisy flowers, dried algae. Hmm. Honestly, this stuff doesn't... I don't really care too much about this. I, I feel like we can worry about this when we need to worry about this, right? This is from the Rangers Guild. It's a whole bunch of fungus and stuff. Uh, I don't mind too much. These swords are really good as well. Uh, selling all these. So much gold. And they make them pretty quickly because it's just a bunch of uh, wood. We can also make this glass blower. That might be uh, fun to have. Hmm. Okay, okay. Uh, I guess we'll we'll leave that. What do, what do we have here? Just the people that joined. Let's uh, clear these notifications. Ah, right. we're back to just how things are. 
Uh, one thing I will want to do as well, I think I want to remove... Oh, this road... See, this is a problem with doing large segments of road. If I want to destroy this bit of road, it gets rid of the whole road I have down here. That is horrible. <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to... I just don't like how thin of a road this is. I'm actually going to make it a, a bit better. Missing carrots. Okay. Uh, I will get this done, though. Let's do this. Oh, okay. I, I thought maybe I could get away with it. Like, overlapping it. But I think I just have to do... Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, let's go... Here. Let's go here. Um, yeah. Okay. We're, we're good. Everything's fine. Everything's A-OK. -okay. That won't look as bad now. The, the little lines look horrible there. That should be good. Now, it, it does look like it's a different color, but I'm pretty sure that's just, uh... Because it's like a preview. I don't know. <laughs> Let's uh, press play. Still get that built. Alright, missing carrots. Let's see what we're dealing with here. We left those carrots out overnight, and in the morning they were gone. Along with the baskets. See, you, you could assume it's just a bunch of, uh, you know, rabbits, but the baskets were gone. Okay. So, there's rabbit people. What is... Oh, I thought this was an enemy. I'm like, what is happening here? <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. Nothing to worry about. Uh, we're getting into a bit of story. So, I assume we should keep an eye on this uh, bunny statue. I assume the fact that we haven't torn it down as well is probably pretty good, right? We, we might get, like, some... some bonus points from the bunny people. <laughs> the, the rabbit people. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Uh, normally, I've found that going two times speed works pretty well. They don't. Uh, they don't just stand there idling, which they do on the the triple speed. Um, so the the double speed's usually pretty good. Uh, they've almost finished these walls. I, I would start building these two other buildings as well, but uh, I'll let them finish this stuff first, right? Did I even place them? No, I haven't placed them. So let's let's actually do that. Um, so here we go. We want to rotate this. Oh, I want it to be symmetrical too, don't I? Um, okay. New title. Okay. Oh, and another thing is I moved the, uh, the bees from over here to over here. So that way you'll only take damage from the bees if you're in the area. And I guess we could put a chest here with some bee-proof, uh, uniform. But, I mean, our cleric, for now at least, uh, heals them up pretty well. Uh, let's press play again. Okay, what is the distance here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, right? We have a 9 gap. 9 gap, 1 away. So, 1, 2, 3, wait. Yeah, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. That should be good. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. That should be good. <laughs> I hope. I hope I somehow haven't done this wrong. Um, everything's fine as well. This, sh this should be a good pl blueprint. There shouldn't be anything wrong with it. Um, we'll just leave that there. Right? We don't have to worry about it. Uh, we can spin this around, and this one's easy to place. We just line it up. Perfect. Uh, daily update. Let's have a look. We actually can get a new person. Barely. Barely. Um, yep, we'll go for it. I don't mind. Monty Oppen. If it does get too laggy, and we decide it's because of the people, I mean, you know, we, we can make some sacrifices. <laughs> we can send them off, you know. Uh, I think we're pretty good, though, at the moment. So yeah, once these walls are complete, uh, we'll get those buildings. One of them will be for the sheep. The other one, we could leave for a little bit. Uh, I'm not too sure, though, yeah. I, have, I haven't decided what the play is. Um... As for whatever... Oh, another thing I need to address is the storage system, right? I found that they weren't actually storing stuff in the upper chest, which which I had hoped they would. So I'll move them out here, and if we have a look... Check out this. Um, 61 out of 64. 61 out of 64. Six, uh, 58. These are all pretty much full. 53, 64, 61. They're just full. The, they've got a crazy amount... Apparently, berries. Okay. I, I didn't actually have a proper look. In fact, if we go into this view... Yeah, it looks like we have a lot of berries. Um, 
Where can we see this? Oh, look at how much thatch we have. That's a lot of that. We, we need to build some things out of thatch, I think. Um, but where's our food? Was that our food? No, that was thatch. 57 berries and 18 sugar bells. Okay. Oh, wow. Look at all this bug meat. Okay. So, bug meat and berries. That We have a lot of carrots because uh, we just bought a heap. And that probably means that we have a lot of other stuff as well because they're replacing ingredients with carrots and whatnot. Um, the bug meat is crazy though. Uh, because we're not using it for anything at the moment. Let's search bug. Okay, we can make a bug stew. That's e easy, easily done. Oh, it's, it's, only, it's not good though. We can do a bug kebab, but once again, that's not good at all. Okay. What, what do we use the bug stuff for? I mean, these just have bug in the name. I assume, is that everything that would re use a bug? Like, is there a kibble I can make with bug meat? <laughs> um, okay, what's this kibble use? Egg? Um, ostrich. Ostrich? Hard seeds? Sheep? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. But we have a lot of bug meat. Maybe I'll turn the bug uh, field off because we're just not using it. Maybe I can sell it? That might be a play. Um, but for now, yeah, let's just let's just replace that with the small animals. We use the meat and the pelt a lot more. A lot more, so we'll leave that for now. Uh oh, are these done? Almost. I think that just placing the um Are you trapped up there? I mean you do have this ladder. But yet you look trapped. Um I might teleport them down, just because they look to see like they they look like they're having a bit. Oh no, there they go. Something kicked them into gear and they they've moved. Okay, both the walls are complete. Perfect. We can uh, get one of these buildings built. Uh, I want to go for this one personally, and we'll slap a ladder on it later as well. Yeah, we'll get that one built. That should be all good and well. Uh, what do we have? The new person who joined. Nothing more on the rabbit people. I'm hoping we can we can get something happening this episode. Because uh, I was just kind of, you know, letting things happen this episode. I was hoping we'd, we'd have a bit of story to go on. So we've got some guilds that will be coming up to us soon. And something about rabbit people. <laughs> uh, we can fast forward. We should be able to. Oh. Um, another thing I've noticed with the building is... I... I this is how I feel, at least, with the building. I feel like if someone comes to bring the wood to do this bit, they'll bring the wood, and then they'll leave, and then someone else will come to do something else, right? And it ends up, like, one person from the opposite side of the map comes to do each different part of a building. And, and it's a little bit irritating. That's why I thought maybe lowering the amount of workers we have that do building, right? Like, um, I, I think I'll do that again. It, I feel like it makes sense. It makes sense in my mind to lower the amount of uh, builders, right? I'm tempted to even do this guy. These guy, these guys now, they can do literally everything else. They can do the mining. That that's actually very smart. They can do the mining. They can do anything else, and that should be perfect. These guys should be just on the ball. But yeah, we, we should also build some thatch stuff. I don't know what to build out of thatch, but we we do have a lot of it. Um. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. We're just kind of waiting, aren't we? Um, over here, could we build a little path, maybe? Would that help at all? I guess we could build... We could build a, a staircase up. Could we do that? Just just because it'll make it a little bit faster? I think we should. Let's get that done. Um, do a new building. Hopefully they break the top ladder first. What do you reckon? Do you reckon they're going to do it? Place your bets. I, uh, I, yeah, yeah. Oh, nope, they're gonna mine. Oh, God. Yeah, let's make this out of thatch. Let's make a nice thatch staircase. Um, we'll make it nice and yellow. Nice and lemon. Oh, there we go. We can do it like, ooh. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting, to say the least. Uh, can I actually click this and that? I mean, that works, right? How would we... 
that. But then... Down one? No? Is down one not what you would do here? Eh. Oh, it is. That should be good. Uh, build that. Completely out of thatch. Get her going. And then we can click an entirely new building again. And, I mean, we have that, right? We might as well use it. What is this? Yeah, let's get a nice lemon road happening. Uh, I think here, and then here should be good. Might as well get some of it out of our storage. Oh, look at all this gold. Oh, yeah. Is this common materials? Okay. Yeah, this is... Uh, here we go. We, we've, we've done it. We've just achieved... I don't know. Wealth. <laughs> we, we've achieved wealth, everyone. Uh... Oh, we, we can actually make this pasture already, can't we? Um, so, essentially, we want this whole space. Uh, you know what? I'll keep the gap. Uh, I'll keep a two-wide gap. Sheep pasture. Four. Okay. Wait, wait. Before we do this, let's do four. So, four is how much we can have. What if we were to fill it up completely? Do we get more? Like, is, is it enough that we get, like, five? No. See, see we get four regardless. So, so there's no point... In really having that extra space. Well, it, we're purely just going for aesthetics at that point. Um, I'll leave that one gap there as well. Because, I don't know. That's what we've done. Uh, I don't want them to harvest grass. Make sure four is max. It is. And there we go. Um, what I will do is I'll click on this. Sheep produce wool and... S sal wool and seldom. Some milk? I don't know what seldom means. I, I assume it's like... Wool and seldom some milk, you know, like, I, I don't know, like, yeah, I, I, I don't know what that means, I, I can't decipher what it could mean either. Um, slaughtering sheep will produce more raw mutton, jerky, and bone. Uh, what about this? Slaughtering perio will yield meat and often feathers and bone, and, um, slaughter for jerky, pelts, and sometimes bone. So yeah, I need to be slaughtering these more often, <laughs> as horrible as that sounds. Um, do I do that with harvest? I do! Okay. So, let's just get all those. And I kind of want to do the same. We use the eggs for the poyo. So, I kind of don't want to. We could we, Honestly, we could probably get another poyo pasture here if we wanted. Because I feel like we the eggs are way more important. Because we make all those dumplings. Um, uh, oh, you know what I wonder? Can I cancel these tasks? I mean... I know it doesn't work this way, but can I, like, auto-harvest the bunnies? No. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, surely... I don't know. I thought that would be a thing. The ability to have, like, your harvester actually harvest them. I feel like that's weird that it isn't... Maybe there's a mod for that? The ability to have the shepherd, you know, kill a certain amount. Ke keep only a certain amount in the, in the pastures. Um, do we have another one of these as well? Flap one of those down. Uh, what are they called? The, the mangas? Mangas? What are they? It doesn't seem like we have one. Uh, so I will have to craft another. Uh, we gotta keep playing as well. I keep, I keep forgetting. I keep pausing it. Uh, it probably is wrapping up point four of the episode, but I do wanna... I got this. Um, so this is negative one. This is ugly. Um... This is negative... This is ugly as well. I thought maybe we could get a good looking one. What's that? <laughs> Manganese salts? Okay. The one that isn't ugly? No, I don't think there is. Okay. Um, I mean, we'll just make one out of wood then. We might as well. Craft one. When that gets done. Um, okay. Are we doing anything else? Not really. We're just kind of... Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I, I keep forgetting. We need to set up... What we're gonna build. I think since since it seems like we can easily get gold now, which previously I thought we couldn't, I'm gonna set up the automation of the gold flakes. So I believe that will be in here. Um, gold. Um, gold ingots. Oh, so we could turn actual gold into gold ingots. I forget about that. Obviously, we're gonna want to smelt gold. Um, where are the flakes? Does he not make them? Hmm. Uh, maybe this guy does? Gold. He does. Okay. 
Gold flakes times three. One gold bar for three flakes, or one ore for a flake. And we turn two into an ingot. So the three is better, right? Three is better. We want to maintain this at one. So that's maintained. And if we go into blacksmith, does that add a maintain? It does. Perfect. That, that, that's it all done. Um, at least on that side. Uh, in here, we want to make the super fancy bed, which is this. We would like to maintain one. Uh, we also have these comfy chairs being maintained. Actually, no, we have just a heap of them being made. Um, I might change that to be, um, if we go into chair... I want to change that to just be maintaining one. Just so it's a bit cleaner. Um, 20? And this one's what, 24? Yeah. Yeah. Log chair. That's pretty cool. I like that. I like that. Um, is that all? Is that everything? Is that, are we... Also, what was that cheering? What did they finish building? They haven't finished building this. I don't know what they've done, but they've, they've done something and they're happy about it, <laughs> I guess. Okay. <laughs> look, look at all these trees we planted. They're in perfect, uh... Oh, does that mean they'll stay in that perfect, um, form? Let's see. So I did the gather and replant, right? I hope I did. <laughs> okay, it's been a few days and we haven't had another bunny thing show up. Uh, which I'm a little bit disappointed about. The tree? These trees look weird. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. I think once we mine more of this area out, uh, where is it? All the way over here. Oh, look at this. It's already finished. Oh. That is a lot of gold. That is really good as well. Ooh. Okay. Um, I, you know, I understand that they want to come and get their stuff, but if I'm honest, I, I don't think they can. They're kind of trapped up there. <laughs> Not only are they on this level, which I think we do have access to, but they're on the one above that level. <laughs> yeah, they just gotta chill there for a bit. And our blacksmith still is crafting a whole bunch of stuff. I'm pretty sure. Uh, blacksmith. What's he up to? Apparently not doing anything. Um... Blacksmith. I have it so that he can only... So, yeah, he's kind of just doing nothing. Is that because... What's he missing? We have the ore chest here, which currently has silver... Yeah, it just has silver. Are we out of iron? We might be <laughs> We might be out of iron, which is shocking. Um, let's see. Clearly, I guess we don't have copper. And I guess we don't have iron. Okay. Interesting. I'm, I'm quite confused about that. I guess we need to start up this mine again. Um, we resume mining this, and can we actually... I actually want them to stop mining this. I want to suspend that. Yeah, that, that suspends the whole thing. Okay. That should be good. Apparently, we don't have any more iron. I thought we had a heap, so I'm a little bit shocked about that. Uh, I'll have a look around to see if there's another little iron spot somewhere out and about. I'll have a look uh, and maybe get that mining. And I, I guess next episode we'll deal with more of this bunny stuff because uh, it's not really happening this episode, it seems. Which is a little bit disappointing. Um, okay, thank you guys for watching. I hope you did enjoy the video and I hope you guys are enjoying the series. I honestly am loving spring and summer. Just being able to see all the colors, see what we've built. And I feel like it just looks beautiful. Um, do I want to put fences around these? I'm still deciding. We, we kind of... I guess we can. I don't know. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subbing. Um, if you're new here, please do subscribe. Uh, the series has been going on for quite a little while. I don't really plan to stop it anytime soon. I'm still enjoying it. Still learning new things as well. Uh, this is still my first playthrough of it. Uh, so yeah. Uh, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video where... Hopefully we have enough stone that I might start building uh, this bad boy. Okay, goodbye.